to hear kids all over the world singing about Jesus. Let's check out a video of a missionary that has kids there that need to hear about Jesus and how God is helping them. We're the Nelsons in the Dominican Republic. I'm Chad, and along with my wife Terry and daughters Emma and Eliana, we're the directors of Child Hope in the Dominican Republic. We want to see the transforming power of Jesus reach the children of the DR through education and other ministries of compassion. Sometimes we read the stories in the Bible and they seem so distant from our everyday life. God stops the sun in the sky for Joshua. Elijah prays for the rain to stop and it does and he prays again three and a half years later and then God starts it right back up. It's hard to imagine, isn't it? In 2017, Pastor Brian Fisher was leading a missions team from New Life Assembly in Wrightstown, New Jersey. They were coming to the DR to work with Child Hope on the construction of the second floor of the Ephraim Christian School in Santiago, right in the center of the island. Because of the progress on the building, we were at a place where our jobs for the week were electrical work, interior and exterior paint, and getting lots of sand and gravel from the ground to the third floor. These are jobs that require no rain. And we looked at the weather forecast and a ginormous storm was coming through the Caribbean. The storm dumped heavy rains on Jamaica and Haiti. And in some parts of the DR, they received over 15 inches of rain in 24 hours. The team arrived on Saturday, April 22nd, 2017. And guess what? It rained. On Sunday, we went to church and it rained. We were praying that God would clear the skies. It was raining all throughout the country from this storm. We got up on Monday, drove to the school, and no rain hit us. It continued to rain all over the country. We continued to pray and worked again on Tuesday and on Wednesday and on Thursday, dry as could be, and able to do all the work that we had come to do. On Thursday afternoon, we finished. We cleaned up our tools, drove five minutes away to tour the local baseball stadium, and it started to rain. Friday it rained on their day off, Saturday it rained on their day out. I have no doubt that God changed the weather for us. It was like he turned off the faucet right around us until we got the work done, but it continued to flow everywhere else. My God is still the God of the winds and the waves and the sun and yes, even the rain. Isaiah reminds us, who has measured the waters in the hollow of his hand or with the breadth of his hand marked off the heavens? Who has held the dust of the earth in a basket or weighed the mountains on the scales and the hills in a balance? My God is big enough to stop a storm passing through the Caribbean, and he's strong enough for the storm passing through your life today. Wow, God still answers our prayers. He's doing some cool things all over the world. So let's keep praying for our missionaries because God answers our prayers. But let's also keep giving to BGMC. So good job. I'm proud of you guys. Keep it up. See you guys. Have a great week.
Washed by your blood You're making all things new With your spirit in us We're sealed for a life with you Jesus, you are forever